why Zeus get the fix? What's going on? Calm down, such a fuss. We're waiting for Batamix. I'm afraid he's late, as usual. He's here. Please forgive my tardiness, my friends. I left the ring on under a cauldron. How are you? Right the sunlight, but we'll be even righter when get the... Shh! Uh, I will come to the point. You all know of Caesar's plans to conquer the Gaulish village. <clears throat> uh, my village. Not news, huh? Well, I believe... He's a druid's whisker away from succeeding! By Zeus! By Belanus! By Odin! Oh, bye bye. What waffle you get a fix? Thanks to your potions that give superhuman strength to your warriors, your village needn't fear the Romans. To overcome your village, Caesar would need to give his legions a power even more greater than yours. And I don't know of anybody who could harness such a great power. Except us, of course. Precisely. Oh, encore! It's a room, as we say in Rome. <laughs> Marvelous, dear fellow. A fine brace of druids. They are yours, noble Caesar. Make good use of them. Count on me, Getterfix. Take them away! What? Get a fix? A traitor? Who are you to talk about our druid like that? My name is Sam Schiffer, Gaul, and I should know a traitor when I see one. I'm a traitor myself. Traitor to Rome. I'll not betray treachery till treason is reason of Caesar. Pretty, but I didn't understand a word of what he said, Asterix. So you have the gall to come to our village? To slander our druid without evidence? And what's more, you even admit to being a traitor? Yes, well, I'm on your side now, Gaul. Let him finish his story, Asterix! It's true that Getafix has been a bit odd lately. You know, last week, he didn't even want to give me any magic potion. But he doesn't ever give you magic potion, Obelix. You fell in the cauldron when you was little, and that doesn't make our Getafix a traitor. You're not going to believe the first Roman that comes by. Why, Tutatis? He's gone! Just like a thief. I'm here, Gaul. You wanted evidence? I've got evidence! Getafix is golden sickle! Why, Tutatis? If Getafix was here, I'm sure he could give us an explanation of this whole story. But Belenos alone knows where he is now. He's in Las Vegum. What's that, Las Vegum? Las Vegum! Located in the heart of Rome, this city of luxury and pleasure is dedicated to the pursuit of sporting entertainment for the greater happiness of Romans everywhere. Las Vegum is round-the-clock gladiator combat to the goriest death. It's skimpily clad slaves fed to hungry lions seven days a week. But Las Vegum is above all a unique welcome and a festival atmosphere every day of the week in a fairy tale setting. Cross the romantic hills of Lutetia as if you were really there. Laugh out loud with the joyful antics of Pirate Island and spend an unforgettable night in the pure opulence of Caesar's Palace. Las Vegum, the Roman holiday you'll never forget. Opening soon. A Jules Caesar production. A city for games? These Romans are crazy. Asterix, you and Obelix are going to Rome. It's the only way to discover why Getafix has betrayed us. To discover if he betrayed us by the statistics. Well, yes, that's what I was going to say. I'll come with you, Cole. Stay well away from us, Sam Schiffer. This whole thing stinks of a trap. But we have no choice. Right, oh, let's go, Obelix.
What should we do, Asterix? Should I knock? No, Obelix, you'll break it! Well, yes, of course. Psst! Look, Asterix. It's our friend the traitor. You can't get in through the main door, Goals. The park isn't open to the public yet. But I know a secret entrance. There! Behind that block. Over to you, Obelix. Hold this, please, traitor. <laughs> Let's go, Obelix! We wait for you, Sam Schiffer. Go on ahead, go on ahead. I'll catch you up.
I'm so <laughs> Oh, it's kind of you to do that. Don't blame my fight, and it very reminds me of my youth. Me. <laughs> You already know that you by pressing the switch button. It is very useful to that Asterix can do, but not Obelix. And sometimes, for example, co course not. But who's he talking to, Asterix? I don't know, Obelix. This character is worrying me more and more. Same color as Obelix. <laughs> wow! Bumper! With this, you'll be able to jump almost as high as me! You need both cameras to open certain doors. <laughs> and two more torches left. <laughs> this platform attached to a cave. You should know it's evolved. Obelix now only has to stand on the spot marked on the floor to grab them. No need to hold the back. Plenty more later. Maybe even some that move all of their own. <laughs> These doors look reinforced to me. I bet you'll have to be round and strong to be able to smash them. What? There's no move around here. Well, yeah, I, I'm, I'm... One more torch to go, and all the joys of that state are yours. Me, me, oh, And the best for last. It, so move it carefully. It should be able to blow up that wall. But first of all, you'll need to clear the way by lowering this. Try pushing this little. First, get close to it. There's no need to press the button. Everything takes care of itself. Ain't progress a fine thing. Is he taking us for fools, Asterix? <gasps> I know how to push a little stone. <laughs> I'm more worried about that button he keeps on talking about. Don't forget that the bomb gets primed if you hit it or touch a wall with it. Hey, careful over there! to reach the ledge up above. Now you can move the bomb calmly. Get close to the bomb and you'll grab it automatically. No need to press a button. When you have hold of it, move it like you were moving Asterix or Obelix. Be careful. If the bomb touches a wall or if you bash it, it will get primed and then BOOM! Go on. Try moving the bomb. Oh! Later on, I'm sure you'll find other ways to bring... We have to be very careful with this bomb. Yeah. 
Why can't they make little pocket arms these days?
not home. He's right. Run- Open the door, soldier! We have to get in! Sorry, gentlemen, I cannot work. Stand back, Asterix! I'll pay him a visit! I'm going through the door! I ain't gonna work all, even if you had superhuman strength. Which I doubt seeing as this is real life. But even if you had such strength, it ain't gonna work. This door is indestructible. So come back when you've got the entrance fee. Cause this ain't gonna work. <laughs> 